Hi everybody, let's take a look at how to load a big bike safely and easily with the Rampage lift. Here's a Rampage installed in a 6 foot 6 pickup bed. The tailgate can be left on or taken off as it doesn't support the lift at all. The lift has three main components. The base frame and winch, which bolts into the bed, the center slider, which your bike sits on, and the wheel cup table, which holds your bike during the loading process. Here you see the winch cable connection to the wheel cup table and the release latch which secures the cup in the down position. The safety pin which secures the center slider to the base frame so it will not move during transport must be removed to allow the center slider to come out and down into the loading position. Next, place the pin in the number two center slider pin block to lock the slider into the loading position. Then, remove the number one pin from the, sl from the slider to the wheel table to release it. Next, play out the winch cable, moving the table to the bottom of the slider and into the bottom loading position. Here's another look at the wheel cup release latch. Release the catch so the cup will stand up as you play out more winch cable, but first Place the large pin in the number three hole so the table will lock up against it as it pulls forward for loading. Here you see how the soft ties have been positioned around the forks at the triple clamp. Extend them down so the S-hooks of the ratchet straps can attach to them and tie off the tie-off holes at the wheel cup table. Next, roll the bike firmly into the wheel cup and leave it on the kickstand. Then, put on your straps, kickstand side first, and adjust them a little loose so when the wheel cup pulls forward it will compress the front end and stand the bike up. Do not cinch the straps down too tight so the suspension compresses before the wheel cup pulls down as damage to the bike and or the ramp may occur. It takes a little practice at first to get used to uh, the right tension on the straps, but this is the most critical procedure in using a rampage lift correctly. Next, shorten the winch cable and pull the table up against uh, the number three pin, rolling the wheel cup forward. But always be sure that the number two pin is in place before pulling the wheel cup down and standing the bike up. After the wheel cup pulls down, back it off a little so you can remove the number three pin. Now you're ready to load the bike into the truck. As the winch cable winds in, it pulls the wheel table up to the top of the center slide. When the table gets to the top of the center slide, place the number one pin through the ears of the center slide and the wheel table itself. Then back off the tension so that you can remove the number two pin from the slider pin block. Once the pin swap has been done, then you can just play out, uh, reel in the winch and pull the whole thing, center slider and the motorcycle up into the bed of the pickup truck. It really is just that easy.